It took more than two hours and 150 firefighters to get this blaze under control. But it claimed the lives of four fire officers and injured five more. This burning shell is all that's left of the Southwest Inn and Restaurant in Houston, Texas. Conditions were some of the toughest that firefighters have to contend with. Seeding temperatures and strong winds made the fire fast moving and deadly. Average fire at, at uh, our temperature is going to be about five to six hundred degrees. You gear up your body temperature. You're going to be you're, you're going to be at those uh, at that place of exhaustion, probably be within ten minutes. Lunchtime commuters saw the drama unfold as they drove past the hotel, which sits next to one of the city's biggest expressways. This fire is being described by Houston Fire Department as the worst in its 116-year history. It's thought the four firefighters were killed when the building's roof collapsed. Three died at the scene. A fourth died later in hospital. The Houston Firefighters Association says the dead included three men and one woman. Five others are being treated in hospital with chest and leg injuries. Hotel staff raised the alarm and evacuated guests, and it's not believed any of them were injured in the blaze. But investigators will now try to establish what started this fire and why it claimed the lives of so many firefighters. Julie Peacock, BBC News.